hello everybody and welcome to this video and as you can see this uh, loading effect uh, is very very similar to facebook mobile app loading effect and this is what we will implement in today's video now the first step is to add the chimer effect library and uh, we will add it in the dependency section right here and as you can see it is from facebook and then go ahead and sync the project now inside your activity layout file we're going to add an element and this will be the container of your uh, loading effect at all so go ahead and add a chimer frame layout element and then you can set an id the width and height will be set to 0dp because we are using a constrained uh, layout so we need to set it to 0dp and we will stretch it along the screen so we set everything to match then go ahead and close the chimer frame layout uh, tag and if we get if we go to the design you can see there is nothing here just a blank page and the thing is we need to add the design of the the layout the design of the loading layout as you did see in the demo we have some squares and this kind of stuff so we're going to the design the loading layout so we will go to the the layout file and click right click new layout resolve file and you can call it anything i'm going to call it place holder layout and click ok to add it now inside the layout you can design any uh, layout you want if you want uh, images only if you want uh, images with text any type of layout or design that you want you can uh, using for me i will stick to add the first view and this will act as a divider for the layout okay uh, nothing fancy then we will add an image view element nothing uh, new here call it an image view avatar and it have a background of color gray and i will set the mar the layout constraint to match parent and then i will add another text view right here and i will style it to make it large the background we will set to the gray color that i have in my colors xml and you can set the tools text right here so you can see design from here as you can see and the background i set it to gray and this is very important so we can clearly see it in the loading effect i have the in the values folder i have in the colors i have this color gray just a simple color right here let's go to to code again and again let's make an app compact text with a gray background also and i will constrain it to this text view and i can set also a text right here if you go to the split you can see the design we have a simple three elements right here two text view one is large and another is uh, just a simple text without any style and of course an image view so let's go ahead to the the activity main again and inside this chimer frame layout we need to add inside it since this is a, a container kind of layout so we need to add another element inside it so let's go ahead and add it and the element will be a linear layout of type vertical and we'll make it a match parent and the height will be wrap content and inside it we will include our placeholder layout we will include a bunch of times like many many times as you can see we will include it we say at layout placeholder layout or any name that you have got to the layout file and uh, we would, we did this because we need to cover uh, the large phones layout we need uh, we need a lot of elements to cover the layout so we have all this kind of stuff and finally we will uh, close the linear layout so we will we are done with the design let's go to the activity main or main activity so for now we will start off by getting 
a reference to the Chimer frame layout using find view by ID and install it in a val called Shimmer view. And we will simply call Shimmer view dot star Shimmer. Of course, we don't really need uh, this semicolon. If we run the application, now as you can see, we have this beautiful loading and not boring uh, effect, kind of like you see it in a Facebook app, and it is very, very cool. And if you have to load some data from the internet, you can use this as a placeholder, and then once the data is available, once the data is available from the internet, you can simply hide this uh, placeholder or this Chimmer frame layout, and for example, show your recycler view. You would simply toggle the visibility of the two layout as simple as that thanks for watching have a nice day don't forget to follow me on instagram linkedin 